Patuloy ang nagbabagang aksyon ng hardcore dito sa lungsod ng San Juan as we return inside the Phil Oil Flying V Center para sa ating pangatlong laban on this Tuesday kung saan magharap ang San Sebastian College Recoletos ang host school ng Season 93 at ang kupunan ni Gab Dagangon ang University of Perpetual Health System Delta Altas. This is Season 93 of the NCAA hatid sa inyo ng SNA and we are also seen live on SNA HD Sky Cable Channel 166. We're also greeting everybody watching all over the world sa pamamagitan ng the Filipino channel and to those watching via live streaming sa sports.abs-cbn.com. Kasama ang mga maritime students ng Perpetual sa Las Piñas. Kasama ang kanilang idol na si Sir Buzon, ang kanilang instructor. Ako po ang inyong lingkod na si Anton Rojas. Kasama Si Coach Hammer, Martin Antonio. Marts, it's great to be back covering the NCAA. Para mga estudyante natin, natin pahinga muna sa pagpiprepare sa solas. Bukod muna ng basketball, magandang hapon mga kapamilya. Napakaganda na rin ang matutunghayan natin kayo. Buwan na ng Agosto, Marts, at uh, matagal mula nung huling umapak sa hardcourt ang ating mga kupunan. July 20 pa nung naglaro ang perpetual sa Mapua at July 20 naman para sa San Sebastian. Kaya sabik na sabik na ang ating mga nalaro na magpakitang gilas muli dito sa NCAA. Dahil sa sama ng panahon itong nakaraang linggo, Anton, medyo may mga in-preneem tayo na mga laro para rin sa safety ng ating mga estudyante at mga manlalaro. Pero makikita natin ngayon, no team is safe sa ating team standings. Nangunguna dyan ngayon ang LPU Pirates na mamayang pag-immaculate record 5-0. Makikita natin yung dalawang kopulan. Ito, Anton, nasa harapan natin ngayon. Nasa ipaba sila, tied at 1 and 2. Isa dyan aalag mapapunta sa itaas. At kanina, nanalo rin ang Colegio de San Juan de Letran kontra sa Arellano University. Kaya naman, naalok na naman, March, ang ating team standings. Dikit-dikit nga sila dyan eh, 2 and 3. Itong dalawang teams ngayon, 1 and 2. Ang nakakaangat lang talaga, itong ang LPU Pirates 5 and 0, ang San Benaret Lions. Iisa lang ang talo, 4 and 1. Ang Perpetual started the season 0 and 2, pero nakabawi sila sa kanilang huling laban at the home of the Cardinals winning a very important matchup. And that man on your screens, Prince Ese, grabe yung pinakita. Monster numbers, 21 rebounds in the game against Mapua. He is the number one rebounder dito sa NCAA ngayon. Masasabi nga natin na siyang nagtitimo na ngayon. Undisputed center and leader ng kanilang interior itong si Prince Eze. At napakaganda rin ang kanilang inilaro nun. Labing pitong points of turnovers, labing pitong assists. At GJ Ilaga ng kanilang kapitan, napakaganda ng leadership. At sa dulo siya ang nag-deliver sa kanilang panalo. Nanguna si GJ Ilaga sa laban na yun, tallying 13 points ang kapitan ng Altas. But we expect Gap Dagangon, who scored a season-low 2 points in that game, to bounce back to Day. Pero siyempre, si Prince Ese ang bumida para sa Perpetual with that 21 rebound output. Ngayon naman ang mga kalaban nila, 
is another team that is very capable of making it to the Final Four. Ang host school ng Season 93, ang San Sebastian Stags. At grabe rin yung kanilang pinakita against LPU. They stuck with the Pirates, but in the end, it was that big three by MJ Ayaay that put the Stags at bay. Napakaganda nga ng laban ni Ron Anton. Up and down. Deep in sahan ng full court, pukpukan hanggang sa dulo. MJ Ayaya nagbigay ng uh, napakaganda laro sa dulo doon para sa LPU Pirates. But do not discount it. 26 offensive rebounds para dito sa San Sebastian Golden Stags. Kontra sa labing tatlo lang ng uh, LPU Pirates doon. Makikita mong tinatrabaho talaga nila doon. At si Michael Kalisaan ng una doon, dalawang put, walong puntos, labing dalawang rebounds. Pero... Ang talagang bumabandera sa kanila, itong si Alin Bulanati, a revelation. Number two, efficiency player nila. Labin dalawang puntos, limang rebounds, isang steals, number one yan sa kanyang kumpunan. Itong si Alin Bulanati na tubong Davao City, sumali lang sa basketball dahil sa libre pagkain kapag ikaw ay varsity player. Pero ngayon, pinapaturayan niya na hindi lang siya saling pusa, hindi lang siya sumali dahil sa libre pagkain at allowance. Kasali na siya dahil gusto niya makilala bilang isa sa pinakamalupit na manlalaro dito sa NCAA. Bagay na bagay siya dyan kay Coach Egay Makaraya. Ang gusto ni Coach Egay Makaraya sa players, matatapang at talagang may gustong patunayan. Kaya makikita natin ngayon kung kukuhanin pa ng Golden Sags ang kanilang ikalawang panalo ngayong Season 93. At nagbabalik rin sa ating broadcast, ang ating kasama at courtside, si Binibining Roxanne Monte Alegre. Hi, Rox! Hi! Magandang hapon sa inyo, Anton, Coach Hammer, at sa ating mga kapamilya all over the world and all over the Philippines. I'm sure nag enjoy kayo dito sa season. At kagaya nga lang sinabi nyo, na-cancel yung two games natin. Pero babawi kayo sa pagsagot ng ating question of the day. Na bagay na bagay sa ating uh, maula na panahon. Kung, sino, kung merong NCA player na gusto mong pumayong sa'yo, sino yon? at bakit? Para sa inyo, Coach Hammer and Anton, sino? Uh, Rox, siguro dating player na lang si Coach Hammer. No, <laughs> napakarami ng pumayong sa akin. Si Sam Ekwe, <laughs> sila Al Magpay, sila Ron Kapati. So, sobrang daming pumayong wala akong na-shoot. I think Kaya alam ko kung bakit. <laughs> Kasi para kahit sa baha, mabuhat ka rin niya. <laughs> anyway, mga kapamilya, gamitin nyo ang hashtag namin, NCA Season 93. Hashtag NCA Strong. Kung meron din kayo mga comments, opinions, mga photos na gusto i-share. At kung gusto nyo pa rin makilala ang ating mga players, huwag na kayong mahiya at makisali kayo sa fun dito sa San Juan Arena kahit wala kayo dito live. So abangan namin ang mga tweets nyo. We'll uh, see you again later. See you later, Rox, and thank you very much. Subukan natin ipatrend ang ating hashtag NCAA Season 93. Sa aming pagpabalik, it is Perpetual versus San Sebastian dito sa Season 93 ng NCAA Live on SNA. Boys guard, Gab Dagangon, shooting guard, Daryl Singetico, guard forward, DJ Ilagan, shooting guard, Eze Prince, center, Ryan Costello, point guard, Alfred Gayosa, forward, Alin Bulanadi, forward, Mike Kalisahan, forward, JM Kalma, center, Ayan po ang mga starting units ng Perpetual at ng San Sebastian. Maraming salamat muli sila pagtutok ngayon sa NCAA Season 93. Live po tayo sa SNA at sa SNA HD. Sky Cable Channel 166. All over the world via the Filipino Channel. And via live streaming sa sports.abs-cbm.com. Two teams na may kakayahan na makarating sa Final Four, magbabanggaan. If we're gonna look at the team standings, we're gonna see that they're close to the bottom. Pero alam natin ang capabilities na mga kumunan ni Coach Jim Welgikan at Coach Egay Bakaraya. Pantay na pantay ang ating liga ngayon, Anton. Uh, the parity is there. Very competitive ang lahat ng laro natin ngayon. Wala talagang uh, malaking tambakan kung tatawagin natin. Pero digdigan. Ryan Costello in the starting unit for the very first time dito sa Season 93. I was talking to him, asking him why he only played one game so far. Meron daw pala siyang injury sa kanyang kamay. Pero ngayon, 
ang kanilang uh, kapitan na si Ryan Costello is in the game to start off Season 93 dito on this Tuesday at the Phil Oil Flying V Center. Maganda Anton, malaman natin kung ano yung extent ng injury niya na yun kaya na-miss niya yung uh, dalawang laro. Costello, umatake. Ryan Costello, best firing on that shot. Sigo Tico with the rebound. A matchup between two heavy point guards, si Costello at si Keith Pido. Inside pass, Ilaga, nakita si Prince Essex. Anton, gumanda yung finishing nito ni Prince Eze. Last year, medyo hindi pa ganun kasuabe yung touch niya pagdating sa mga dive niya na ganun. Binsan, binabalibag niya. Pero doon, nakita natin na maganda yung bitaw niya ng bola. At maganda rin ang bitaw dito si Michael Calisan knocking down his first three-pointer on this Tuesday. Mas mataas na ang confidence level ni Michael Calisan. Nung panahon na early 90s, yung mga ganyang posisyon, yung masyado kong hindi ka ganun kabilis para maging wing, hindi ka rin katangkaran para maging big man. Medyo nagiging twitter, hindi na ma-maximize. Pero Michael Calisa, napakaganda ng inilalaro. But 28 puntos na nakaraang laro. Big double-double para sa kanya. Ngayon, isang three-pointer para simulan yung laro. Follow on Ryan Costello has got the gang on. They have to get him going. Dito sa laban na to, dahil nga, tahimik itong si Gap sa kanilang huling laban. Just two points. One of his worst outings dito sa NCAA. So it's very essential for Perpetual to get him going. Two for two on that trip to the nine para kay Gap Dagangon. Costello. Gayosa. Ball was tapped by Sigo Tico. Mananatili dito sa San Sebastiano possession. Costello. Bulanadi has the basketball. Bulanadi, umigot. Tumira. Bulanadi, unable to get it to fall. Ese with the board. Makikita mo, Anton, si Alin Bulanadi. Mataas talaga yung kumpiyansa ngayong taon. Nakaka-create na siya ng tira. Last year, catch and shoot lang. Ngayon, binibigyan na siya ng pagkakataon ni Coach Egay na humanap ng mga spots kung saan siya makakakuha ng puntos. Sigon Tico shoots over Costello. There is Sigon Tico! Talking about speaking your spots, that is Sigon Tico off the pin down. Naganda nung entry na yun ni Keith Pido and the three-pointer for him. Coach Egay Makaraya calls for a time. Perpetual leads Baste 7-3. Welcome back, mga kapamilya, dito sa NCAA Season 93. Kanina nabanggit ni Coach Hammer at ni Anton Rojas na si Prince Eze ay Prince of Rebounds. Pero alam niyo ba ang ultimate goal talaga niya? Na isang araw ay eh, matawag din siya na Prinsipe ng Perpetual Health. Pero alam niyo, bago siya naging Prinsipe ng Rebounds, ito ang alam niyo sa madaming rejections. At ang unang pagkakabigo niya ay ang hindi nabigay sa kanya ang inaasam niyang position na naglalaro pa siya ng soccer. Yun ang kanyang first love. Pero ngayon, ang basketball is his magagaling at malalakas na players kasi it means strong. So yun ang gusto niyang ipakita ngayon dito sa game na to. So abangan natin ano pa ang magiging contribution niya, Anton? Maraming salamat, Roxanne. Itong si Prince Ese was born in Itugu, Nigeria. And he only started playing basketball at the age of 14. He's 23 right now and he couldn't get that block on Gayosa. You have to be very smart under the basket when you try to shoot over Ese. Good ball fake there by uh, Gayosa. Maganda sana makita natin yun na street ball sports. Ito, ang ganda rin pagkakuha ng agaw doon. Makikita mo doon, yung ball fake. Faking the sucks out of uh, Prince Eze. And that's what Gayosa brings to the table. His energy, his length. 
and the effort also. Kailangan mo talaga sa team yun, Anton, yung mga players who would do the dirty work, getting those loose balls, kung nagsiset ng screens, hindi mo kailangan magtakbo ng play para magbigay sa'yo ng uh, puntos. Ese. Ilagan, binigay dito kay Pido. Pido, Singontico, attacking Daryl Singontico, unable to put it down. Bulanali with the board. RK Ilagan. At my offensive foul that tinawag dito kay Mercado. Makikita mo, Anton, ang ganda nung rim run neto ni uh, Justin Mercado from the defensive end going down. Pero makikita lang na iwinasiwas niya ito si GJ Ilagan. Medyo mayroong uh, magandang pagkakabit. Anong tawag doon kung si GJ Ilagan sa hip check na binigay ni uh, Justin Mercado. Samantala, bite ng tres ni Daryl Sigontico, R.K. Ilagan. Oh, keep it off bothering R.K. Ilagan. Gayosa with a fake. Gayosa with a drive. Alfred Gayosa Alfred with a basket. Gayosa. Awkward pa yung atake niya na yun eh. Pag talon mo ng kanan, usually you finish with the left hand, pero short jumper pa yung itinira niya. But Alfred Gayosa still getting the right mix and getting that shot to go in. After that timeout by Coach Egay Makaraya, tabla na po tayo, 7-all. A 4 to nothing run by San Sebastian. Dagangon, nabitawa ng bola. Alit bola, Danny will finish on the break. Make that a 6 to nothing run by San Sebastian. Stags, 9, Altas, 7. Magbabalik po ang season 93 ng NCAA. Ayan po si Michael Calisana, pambato ng Santa Rita, Pampanga. 28 points, a season high for Michael Calisan. Tandaan natin ang kanyang career high was 35 last August 7, 2015 against LPU. A 77-70 win. Ang mabigat doon nandun, yung 55% shooting. Kasi bibigyan ka talaga niya ng double-double, pero yung binibigay niyang percentages, yun yung mabigat eh. Uh Oo. -oh. Ilagat. Threw it away. Hindi sigurado si Alfred at si Michael kung kanina magpupunta yung pasa. Pito. Nahulog si Ilagan. Si Contico, Aaron Pass. Here come the Golden Stags. Rumarachada, Kalisan. Offensive foul at tinawag kay Michael Kalisan. Ang ganda naman ng defense doon ni GJ Ilagan. Talagang sinabayan niya and giving himself up to take that hit on the chest. Tingnan mo ito, Anton. Textbook play, putting your body in the middle of the basket and the, and the offensive player. Taking the contact. Pangalawang offensive foul niya na nakuha ni GJ Ilagan ang tol. Let's see if that will shift the momentum. Kasi merong 6 to nothing run. Itong San Sebastian Pido. Nahuli. Offensive foul. Nakakatuwa rin panoorin itong si R.K. Ilaga. Last year, hindi mo makikita ganyan siya pong ganyan from measure on the ball, Anton. Kanina nakakuha siya ng isang turnover. Ngayon, nakakuha na naman niya ng isang offensive foul. Itong si Pido. Ilagan. Inside pass to Mercado. Stone and away by Eze. Flash sa diwa. Pumasok sa unang pagkakataon dito sa laban na to. Sa diwa. Pido. Using the Eze screen. Keith Pido. Floater. Wala. Bula Nani with the board. Ilagan. Loses control. Ilagan. Oh! Ball was stopped by Bunanadi as GJ tries to get himself going dito sa laban na to. Ang ganda rin nung uh, hustle back na yun ni uh, Alin Bunanadi. Not giving up on the play. Kahit two steps behind siya. Goes inside and gets a great tap out. 
Renzo Navarro, dating San Sebastian Staglet, former LaSalle Green Archer, going back to his roots as a member of San Sebastian. Basic inbound play doon, and Tony just lobbing up on the big guy, Prince Eze, napakahaba ng mga galamay. Just put it up there, makakuha yun ang shot attempt. Di man niya na na-convert, ito makakuha siya ng dalawang free throws. Para sa'yo, Martin, ano yung pinakamalaking pagbabago sa laro nitong si Prince Eze? Ngayon na siya na ang backbone ng Perpetua. Unang-una, as a player, wala ka nang iisipin dahil ikaw, nasa yun yung playing time. Uh, ikaw ang kanilang foreign student athlete na nagtitimon sa gitna. All the confidence should be on you. He just needs to work on his post games even more. Dahil mechanical pa rin siya gumalaw eh, instead of being more fluid. But on the defensive end, laging nanduro naman yan eh. And I guess that's also because last year, he really had to focus on being defensive. Kasi si Akweti was uh, the offensive guy. So when Ese comes in, he changes the complexion of the game. But now that he's in the game longer, he's got to make an impact offensively. Speaking of offense, Yuiko, that's offense for the bench. Ang ganda ng pagkaka-reverse na off that secondary break. Reversal, ang ganda ng pick-up na yun. And pull-up three, Anthony Yuiko. Let's take a look at this drive by Saliwa, finding John Yuiko. Nothing but that. You know, 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 Alin Bulatani! Alin Bulatani! Yan ang sistema ni Coach Eke Makaraya. Anton, he wants a fast game, forcing turnovers, creating easy shots. Matatandaan natin, pre-season, sinabi niya hindi sila yung pinakamalaking team, hindi sila ang pinaka-skilled, pero sila magiging pinakamasisipag at pinakamatatapang sensei. Sa Tiwa. Oh, Gayosa again! Stealing it away! Gayosa! Oh! Tumama sa kanyang tuhod. But the effort again from Alfred Gayosa. A vivo, perfect shot, perfect selfie. Alin Bulan Nari. From Davao City. Yan ang magandang matutunan ng mga bata ngayon, Anton. Sabi ni Gilbert Arenas dati, paano siya nakakakuha ng double-digit scoring? Force turnovers, run the break, mga libre yan eh. Maka dalawang ganyan ka lang per quarter, eh. makakalabing dalawang puntos ka, labing anim na puntos. And that's by playing defense and forcing turnovers. Sabi nga nila, simple lang, basketball. When you think of it that way, the little things can lead to something big. And speaking of big, wala kang magagawa kay Ismite. Pag ganun na kalalim, Prince Eze, nakakonvert dun sa high-low na yun. Mercado had to draw out Eze. Eze with another rebound. Both teams split their meetings in season 92. Ilagan throws it down low to Ese. Double team comes. Sadiwa. Binigay dito kay Yuhiko. He passed it underneath to Coronel, and Coronel didn't like the entry pass. Dalawang bases na lalain at tinakbo Antonio Horns na play na yon. Down screen, and then gusto nilang iswing kukuha ng post up kay Prince Ese. Hindi ba sila nakakakuha out of two tries? Tingnan natin kung itatakbo pa ulit ni Coach Jimol Gika niyan at ni Consultant Nick Omorogbe. Mercado will try another three. Justin Mercado! And speaking of running a play twice, Justin Mercado making a three on the harsh mark para dito sa San Sebastian Golden Stags. Justin Mercado only made four three-pointers last year. Out of 17 attempts. And that was actually just his second three-pointer of the season in five attempts. Anton, you got to commend the defense of the San Sebastian Golden Stags. 
kahit hindi man si hindi man sila maka-force ng turnover, makikita mo nasa harapan sila eh. Pero ito, yung atake, again, breaking down, hindi ro-rotate si Prince Eze pag ganun kataas eh. So, kailangan makuha mo yung outside shot na yun para lalabas ang kaka. So, Michael Are, one of the new additions na San Sebastian dito sa season na ito. Jason David. Na napilitan umadjust itong si Coach Jim Wilgeekan at itong si Consultant Nick Omorogbe. Naglagay sila ng quicker guy. Nakakuha sila ng isang foul. Lalabas talaga at lalabas dahil nakashoot na ng isang three-pointer. Lalo na malaking mama itong si Justin Mercado. The Gamon. Coronel gets it from Lucente. Yuiko. The Gamon. Oh, the Gamon. Called for traveling. Gamon to the foul. Different look yung binigay doon. Flex action. Nakita natin, dalawang down screen on the baseline. Gap the Gamon. Pero ang ganda ng recognition ng defense ng San Sebastian Golden Sags. Off that screen, ang ganda ng help side na cause ng turnover. Under a minute to play here in the first quarter. Navarro. Navarro with a drive. Kicks it out. Valdez. David from the free throw line. Tapos. It is perpetual basketball. O sa Diwa. Di siya handa para sa pasa na yun. Mula kay Yuiko. Yuiko nabitawan ng bola. Almost a steal by David. Oh, this is just... Unstable basketball being shown by Perpetual. Credit that to the defense oh, ng San Sebastian Golden Sacks since the tip off. Anton, grabe promesure to mga players ni Coach Egay Makaraya. Right in front of you, active hands, nakaka-force ng mga tape. Yung mga 50-50 balls, yun yung uh, nagpabago ng complexion ng laro eh. And that's what you were explaining earlier. Um, Echoing uh, the comments, the words of Coach Egay Makaraya about San Sebastian being a scrappy team, a team that will grind it out, put the effort, put the work in, and that's how they're gonna pile up the wins this season. I would personally love to play for Coach Egay Makaraya, given an opportunity na ganun. You you just run the play, play hard defense, and find an opportunity to shoot. Who wouldn't love to play for a coach like that? San Sebastian with a one-point lead. Are, binigay dito kay Navarro. Navarro, back to Kalisan. Kalisan trying to drive baseline, a steal by Sadiwa. Coronel, back to Sadiwa. Sadiwa with one second to go. At maubusan ang oras sa perpetual. It's been a seesaw battle here in the first quarter. Panorin natin ang mga highlights. Prince Ese leading the Altas with four points. Costello finding Michael Calisan, his only field goal and only shot attempt in the first quarter. Ito namang si Singuntiko, hindi magpapatalo. Also knocked down a triple of his own. Gap Dangangon loses control. Bulanadi gets it on the break for the finish. And of course, other players making their presence felt. Itong si John Yuhigo, nagpakawala ng tres. And Michael Are, finding Justin Mercado, his second three-pointer of season 93. Ating talahan sa dulo ng first quarter. 14, San Sebastian, 13, Perpetual. Magbabalik po ang NCAA season 93 para sa quarter number two dito na sa SNA.